Hello, I'm Howard Monroe from CBS3 in Philadelphia. Let's start with a look at the forecast of meteorologist Tiffany Savona. Good evening, Howard. We're going to keep that chance for a couple of showers and thunderstorms in the forecast overnight out ahead of our next cold front. It stays warm. It stays muggy with temperatures only dropping into the upper 60s by Sunday morning. Sunday morning will feature a lot of clouds and possibly a couple of lingering showers, but then that will give way to plenty of sunshine Sunday afternoon and it will be warmer tomorrow. 84 degrees, but still comfortable. 86 on Monday, an isolated late day shower or thunderstorm possible on Monday as well. And then we dry out and it'll start to feel more fall like with high temperatures in the 70s. Howard. A disturbing discovery in Smyrna, Delaware. Authorities confirm human remains of a child under 10 years old were discovered at a baseball field. Police say the body was discovered in the area of the Little Lass Field. The child is believed to be under 10 years old. This is an active investigation. If you have any information, you are urged to call police. Uber driver Zacharias Georgialis is under arrest for unlawful restraint and recklessly endangering another person. Westchester police say two women flagged down an officer on the 300 block of Fastnaught Alley early Friday morning. They were visibly upset and said Georgialis locked them in his car, then started going the opposite way of their destination. Police say when the women tried to escape, he repeatedly locked the doors. Georgialis remains in Chester County Prison on $20,000 bail. Food that's loaded with salt now comes with a warning label in Philadelphia. A new law kicked in today requiring chain restaurants in the city to display a warning label on any single menu item that has more than 2,300 milligrams of sodium. That's the recommended total for an entire day. Remember, you can always get the latest on these stories and more right here on CBSPhilly.com. That's the latest for the evening digital brief. I'm Howard Monroe.